is a response video to one that I saw somebody making one of these it's a bit wet today as rain is splashing up everywhere I um, basically shoved the sawdust in there and put a had a tin can down here and a pipe down there so it's now fairly compact and as you can see there's light coming down through there um, and we're going to have a go at setting light to this. Let's see how we do. Sorry about the camera work. I'm on my knees. See if anything catches fire. Seems like things have caught fire already. Some of them anyway. Yep, that seems to be going. I don't know how long that'll last, but we'll see. So far so good. I'm looking down in there. I see some flame taken. Looking down the top again. Definitely looks like it's taking off. The um, flames just starting to come out the middle now. I mean, up top, just breaking the top of it. Maybe not the best day or place to be doing this. Just inside my garage door. Oh boy, that's really taking off now. That's that's fantastic. I'm pushing a little bit. Oh. I'm pushing just a little bit further out. Wow, that's that's certainly taken off now, hasn't it? That didn't take very long to take off at all. And with a little stand on top of that. I think if you had if you had something to put the pipe in the bottom and in the top, you could transport it with the with with the lid on, you could transport it with the shavings in there, all ready to go. But uh, in terms of heat output um, and the fact that it's holding together whilst burning is pretty impressive. I see, I can see blue in the flame down in the chimneys, in the tube itself, um, and obviously a very orange flame at the top um, is charring around the chimney. I'll give it a test and see how. Um, how well packed the shavings are. Tapping obviously brings the coals down in the middle. Um, but it hasn't collapsed yet, even with that bit of movement and stuff. Hmm. It must have exposed some fresh wood, because I've got some flame there. Maybe that's the thing to do. If it goes out, give it a tap, get it going again. I waited for the wind to be coming from behind me because it went out again, so I'll give it a few really good taps. Oh wow, yeah. Plenty of sparks coming up. The flame's going again. You definitely want to be doing that when the wind's blowing from behind you, not towards you. I'm looking now from the back of the chimney. I'm not sure if you can see out the front. I certainly can. You can see at the front of it there. If I move a little bit maybe you can see the ground not moving. Get that parallax effect. And, um, a little bit's dropped out the front. The actual chimney part hasn't dropped off the front yet. Certainly getting very very hot around the entrance. You can see the white area. It's obviously I don't know, burnt something away, maybe it burnt the paint off or... So as people say, if you're doing this, make sure you burn it outdoors for the first time, at least well away from everything and don't inhale. But it's almost like the coal inside fuses the, um, the shavings together and holds it together, because you can see it moving on the outside, but the, the chimney seems to sort of stick together. 
when I've switched to my son's camera um, just so you can see because the battery died on my other camera it's almost like it's formed a, a coconut type shape because the walls at the back have collapsed forwards and I suspect the front may have gone all together I know there's a little bit left in the front there now just a little bit left in the front but um, the heat is obviously generating a smoke from the the shavings at the back um, there's not a lot of airflow back there so you can see that the smoke sort of dancing about and I suspect as it's rising up it's gaseating or, or being burnt up by the by the heat from the fire in front which as I said before is definitely hot enough as you can see now there's um there's hardly any smoke coming from this it's almost smokeless Clearly once it gets going, you don't have the sort of smoke problems I had when it first started. Um, it's very, very hot. There's no shortage of heat in there. It's burning down nicely. Um, down inside it's really, really hot. Well, as you can tell, the uh, fire's gone down a bit, so... Got a broom handle here, I'm gonna give it a few taps. Just see what happens.